I'm back again. Um, I did a video on this before, but I'm I'm gonna do another one on it just because. Uh, yeah, I feel that uh, I, I I like these drawings and uh, I I drew them, so I'm just trying to share it with you people. I hope that you like them. If you whatever drawing you like the most, uh, let me know. Uh, just uh, yeah, I would I would appreciate it. And whatever ones you hate, uh, you can let me know. But I I would I'd like some uh, positive or constructive criticism. I don't like negative criticism, like, just like, that drawing sucks. How, what the fuck do I learn from that, you know? Like, what sucks about it? Like, um, yeah, so I'm gonna show you some of my drawings. And I also recently started painting. Uh, I'm not really awesome at painting, so I'm sorry if, uh, it's not perfect. But, um, this is a pencil drawing that I did. Um, and all, pretty much all of these, except for one of them, I traced, okay? One of them I traced, cause, so, just because, uh, I'll explain later. Um, um, what do you think? It's cool? Not cool, what do you think? Is it pretty or not pretty? I don't know. Give kind of like the emo hair look. Trying to hold it as perfectly parallel to the camera as possible, because obviously if I tilt it, it's going to fuck it up, right? So. This is, as, I think, as parallel as possible. This is the first one. This one's just pencil on normal paper, okay? Uh, this is the painting I did. Um, see if you can guess who it is. Am I holding it parallel? Am I? I like it better in person than when I'm seeing it on the video, but that's just because, um, well, it's like inverted to me, so I don't know. But, I think it's kind of cool. It's supposed to be me. Um, I, I didn't trace or anything at all, I just, uh... I had my boyfriend draw my shadow, which was just, like, the outline. Like, so, like, the outer lines of it. He, he traced when I was, like, in with the sun or whatever, so... There was a shadow cast. And then the rest I just kind of eyeballed, so... It's obviously not exactly like me. But, uh... I think it's cool. And that's with paint, so not bad for one of my, like, I think it was my third attempt at painting ever. Like, well, a face anyway. Uh, this one I think I might have shown, some of these I showed in other videos, but whatever. Uh, I'm only showing my favorite ones. Whoa. This is my evil girl. She's pretty evil looking, eh, huh? And then I have, like, the hero character, which I, <laughs> which I know this is very stereotyped because that one has black hair and, like, dark eyebrows and everything, and then this one's blonde, but, uh, that's just because we're so brainwashed from Walt Disney, um, but I hope that, uh, you think that they're okay at least. I'm not an expert at drawing by any means, but, uh... I try, you know what I mean? Like, that's the only way to get better. No. This one I really like the eyes of, considering that I just did it, like, uh, like, freehand. Not that bad, eh? Not that, not too shabby. Um, this one is the only one that I traced. And it's because it's like, I think it's Tutankhamun. Is this, I think that's the pharaoh. But it's like the only Egyptian pharaoh that looks kind of weird. Like he has the really elongated face. Uh, so I, I wanted to, and, but this is like, when I traced it, I traced, uh, I, I went through Google images and I found a picture of uh, a statue. And this the, the statue is, was kind of destroyed. Um, you could tell that it originally had paint on it. Um, I tried to keep most of the original colors that were there. Um, the red, I, I, I didn't see any red where I put the red, but it was just completely faded off. So I just put red because I thought it looked cool. But uh, the proportions of where the eyes are and the outlines of the face and where the lips are, are like right on the money because I actually put this up to the screen of the, like we, we use um, a giant uh, 
flat screen TV for, and we use that as the computer screen because we don't actually we don't even watch TV because that's just brainwashing bullshit. So um, yeah, so it's very accurate other than like the color. But I tried to bring the statue to life. So, I'm alive. Oh, no. <laughs> but I hope I hope that you like it. Um, the original statue was like really destroyed, so. Um, this one is, uh, I tried to restore him and make him look kind of alive. Because in the statue, he, he looks like a statue. In this, I tried to, you know, give him color to his eyes. Because the statue, he didn't have, uh, like, irises or anything. So, I kind of had to eyeball exactly where I thought they'd go. Because the outlines were there, but... Yeah, I hope that you like that one. Uh, and then this one I did freestyle and I didn't, I didn't, uh, I did not trace this, I swear on my soul. Like the only one that I traced was that Egyptian one that I showed you. Um, see if you can guess who this one's supposed to be. It looks better in person. I did like some, I did uber uber shading, but hopefully it looks okay. Um, I hope that you can tell who it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be Justin Bieber. Um, or not, uh, why did I say Justin Bieber? It's supposed to be Zac Efron. And, uh, the reason why I, uh, well, I, I asked my boyfriend Tristan to just, uh, find someone that was, like, they thought was kind of hot or whatever, and, uh, Google image search it. And if you Google image search Zac Efron, you'll find the one that I was trying to copy anyway, because he has his hand on his head. But on the original image, his hand is like that, and it's actually kind of cut off, like you can't see uh, all of his hands, so I kind of had to, to improvise everything, but I'm not really awesome at drawing hands, but I tried. And yes, I know that his arm is a lot lighter than his face, okay? It was kind of, I wasn't really done drawing it, but I just haven't really worked on it that much lately. So it's a work in progress, okay? And it looks a lot better in reality, like in real life with our eyes. Because there's a lot of detail in the color that you can't really see on the, on the camera anyway. And this one is kind of creepy, huh? Huh? What do you think? It's supposed to be an alien. Because one thing that I really, really hate about uh, media and like the world kind of is how evil they always make them look. And, and if you've seen the movie uh, Paul, then you'll know that like not all aliens are like, and obviously that movie is just fiction anyway, so. But all of our preconceived notions about aliens come from fucking the media and movies and brainwashing bullshit, right? And, like they're all, aliens are always trying to take over the planet. And that's, if aliens want to take over the planet, they probably would have already. Or maybe they did already and we just don't know. But yeah. That's that one. And again, I'm trying to hold it as parallel to the screen as possible. And then this one, I, I did freestyle as well. It's, um, it's, see if you can guess first, huh? Uh, okay, raw. So I don't want it to focus on me at all. Hopefully you can see it okay. And then I'm close. But, yeah, I don't know if, I don't know if you could tell or not, but it was supposed to be, uh, Vivi from, uh, Final Fantasy VIII. I think eight. Eight or nine. If you know, you can correct me on it. I, I it's been a while since I've played them. And I've played almost all of them, so they kind of, I don't know. I don't have them memorized, okay? Like, I know that I think some of them are cool. But, uh, yeah, that was the end of my drawings. So, uh, well, I have more, but those are my favorite ones, uh. Some of them don't look as good on the video just because like, I think it's like flipped, like it's a mirror image and when, it's really weird how our brains work, but you try the, try this at home and like, t let me know what you think anyway, because do a quick drawing and try to make one that you think looks really cool and then look at it in a mirror. And for some reason, uh, I don't know, I always like things that are kind of facing this way, like how I am right now, like if I was, that's why I like, well, Facing this way doesn't really, like, the light is over here, and, like, you're supposed to always kind of, like, be facing the light. So, that's, that's why I, I've been doing that this whole time, if you have noticed. But, um, 
yeah, so since they're mirror image, uh, they're all kind of the opposite of how I would do, draw them if I was going to do it in reality. But uh, yeah, you could just like fucking flip it yourself if you want, or like hold a mirror up and look at them, and then you'll see it from my perspective because I'm not uh, I'm not taking the time to any edit any of this at all. Okay, any of the blah and the ums and s lisps. I don't care. I'm not fucking going through the time for that. I took the time to make a video, okay? And at least I'm not a fucking shy ass like so many people. But, uh, yeah, peace out. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't because I have so many videos and I'm just gonna keep fucking making them until, like, I get some more awareness from people. Um, if you have any ideas for topics or anything, just let me, shoot me a, shoot me a comment or inbox me. Add me as a contact if you want. Uh, share some of your videos with me if uh, they are of similar interest, okay? Because I've had some people inbox me things that are like prayer shit, like Bible, and like that's really not my forte, okay? Like I've said in lots of videos, and I don't know if I said it in this one, but I have a boyfriend, okay? We, we have sex, okay? And uh, yeah, so if you're one of those religious people, please just, just don't, just don't, because, like, I do believe in a god and a higher power and, like, spirituality and all that kind of stuff, but from my perspective, I think that you people are so deluded, and, uh, I'm not, I'm not trying to make it offensive, it's just that, like, it's been, like, they didn't speak English back then, and the Bible's been translated so many fucking times that I just think that it's whatever purity was in it has been lost through man's translation of it. But this video is not about that, it was about my art. So, thanks for watching and bye. Uh...